I'm gonna show you how to make a healthy, easy breakfast from scratch. I've got yummy pancakes and fresh fruit. This delicious, nutritious feast is a great way to start your day. I'm here today with Amanda from Amanda's Chronicle. So tell us a little bit about yourself. Yeah, so I'm about to debut on a new series on uh, my damn channel. I've also been seen on a YouTube channel called Soul Pancake which I know, bringing that to the table over here. Mm, speaking of pancakes, <laughs> you are here on a good day because we're gonna make gluten-free pancakes. Okay, Amanda, mm -hmm. we've got all of our ingredients laid out. I told you, you're not gonna need a batter. We've got some gluten-free flour. Mm -hmm. I've also got some unsweetened coconut milk and I have some organic cane sugar some whole organic eggs and some coconut oil. You can tell I like it's coconut. It's all about coconut today. It's all about the coconut. I've also got some baking soda and baking powder, which is gonna help them rise, mm -hmm. just like a cake. And then I'm gonna add a little bit of lemon zest. So it's a fancy name for the, the peel. This is a really good tool to have. You we're, will impress your friends with this, I We're promise. gonna have a good ziesta. Yes. Here, right? Oh yeah, look mm -hmm. at you. Yeah. All right, okay girl, let's go. Let's go ahead and pour that in. Okay, we're all just, of it? This is, yep, oh, that's good. two cups of flour. Yes. Add okay. in a few spoons of the cocoa powder. That's okay. unsweetened too, and cocoa powder is full of antioxidants. Now, how about cracking eggs? Watch. So you just crack it enough so that the thing doesn't explode, right? Okay. Voila, Beautiful. super easy. All right. You try it. Crack it go. on the edge. So go like that. Yep. Put your fingers in there, just like a Boom. pro. I'm gonna pour in about a cup of coconut milk. You wanna just measure out two spoons for me? Sure, so just a lot of natural sugar. Yep. Gonna go in. Organic cane sugar in there. And then one teaspoon of the baking soda. And to be real precise, mm -hmm. you can take your knife. You wanna do that with the baking powder? We're gonna need two of those. This is very precise work that's being done over here. Perfect, you see this? Yeah. Look at that, nice and level. So where do I find this gluten-free mix? Well, you wanna look for gluten-free flour, not mm -hmm. pancake mix, just the flour, because we've already made our mix. And you can find it at pretty much any grocery store nowadays. Is there any and rhyme or reason? It's just... No, just put some muscle into it. I'm gonna like get it that. started for you, and then I want you to get in there. Just okay. keep whisking until you don't see any lumps. All right, so I've got two spoons of coconut oil. I, you know, Amanda, that's, hmm, I, I have something else for you what? to use. Hold on a second. You might want to get in there with this one. What do you think? Yeah, okay. You want to start it's with that? It's your kitchen. I mean, okay. I'm, not, just, I'm not judging. Yeah, like, get in there. Just, okay. I'm just kidding. Okay. <laughs> Look at this joker. So we've got a hot griddle. Can you just kind of run I your can. hands I, over I, that? I feel you feel it. that? Mm -hmm. Don't touch though. <laughs> um, once you, you <laughs> I told you, it's a siesta. <laughs> Pow, just like that. Is that our, is that our party pop? Yeah, it okay. is. <laughs> You're fun to cook with. Oh, thank you. All right, so <laughs> just got a little, little bit of oil on there so that our mm -hmm. pancakes don't stick. I'm gonna turn the heat down just a little bit so we don't burn these babies. All right. And then I'm gonna take our spoon and ladle this on just a little bit at a time, baby baby spoons. Do you like blueberries? Of course. Okay, you wanna grab some of those? Sure. You see those little bubbles? Mm -hmm. Okay, go ahead and do it now. Okay. Once you see those bubbles start, that's the perfect time. Okay. We're ready to flip. You see those bubbles? Mm -hmm. That means it's time. Just like that. That was a perfect dismount. All right. Okay. You want to try? See. Yes, I will okay. try. Change places. All right. Do it, girl. The sensei and the grasshopper. We're going to see this. Yeah, oh, this like a pro. Even I can do this. All Look right. That. Now, while those cook on the other side mm -hmm. and they get nice and golden brown, I'm going to show you some safe knife handling techniques. Just pop the stem off. And the key is to have a really sharp knife, and then I use a rocking technique. So you keep the tip of the knife on the board and you just rock it back and forth and move your knife like okay. this. Tuck your fingers in, super simple, just like that. Never pick the tip off the board, and then that guides you. Just take that, remember to keep the okay. point the on the board, motion. tuck your fingers in like so that you don't slice them, yep. Okay. okay, push that to the side. And then let's turn the strawberry around like this. Like this. Yep. Okay. Tuck your fingers in. And okay. yeah, rock it back and forth. Rock, Just real simple. This. Rock the baby. Oh my gosh, I'm off of my training wheels. Look at this. All right, good job. These are sizzling like crazy. Flip that.
that baby. These look great. It's smell like incredible. That. Okay, now to finish them off, remember what we talked about, the zest. Yes. A little zest for life here. Just a little tartness. And you want to put some strawberries on there, go a little bananas. I like to put a little bit of yogurt right on the pancakes because then you don't need as much syrup. Now this is where people usually go a little crazy. That would be me. A little cray cray. So I'm glad that We're you're We're gonna take this. it easy. Let's try it. Okay. There's a fork for you and a fork for me. I want you to take the first bite though. Ooh, this is a big step. Now make sure you get a little bit of everything. Oh sure. And we've got everything right here. Yep. All right. That's a big bite for a little girl. Mmm. That's really good. It's almost like a parfait. Mmm. You get the zest flavor, mm -hmm. the fresh pop of the blueberries. Does it work for, for you? A little bit more. <laughs> I'm gonna fight you for that. Right? Look at get this. in there. And that's how easy it is to make my super yummy gluten-free blueberry pancakes. And you don't have to be a magician. Just click on the link below for the recipe and make sure you subscribe so that you get all of my yummy videos. And you can also find me on youtube.com slash amandaschronicles. We'll see you soon. Let's eat.